All right, guys, we're at the White River Knife and Tool booth. I just went by and I saw that they got these new awesome tactical looking tools here. Uh, and this is John. How's it going, John? Can you tell me what's going, going on with these here? Mode. Yes. This, these two new tools are first responder tools uh, designed by Kurt Daly of Daly Tactical. This particular item is basically for coming upon a car accident, getting in the windows, cutting through the metal. Uh, Kurt can shred a car with this pry bar, a few other items on it. And that, that's the life spike. And this model is called the Rescue Hawk. It has the sharp point for hacking. Mm -hmm. It's got a, uh, a sharpened uh, hook here for getting in seat belts. Of course, the front of it, the channel for turning on and off gas valves, and a pry bar. And the pry bar. And it comes in a really nicely designed Kydex sheath, oh, wow, yeah. which has a number of mounting options. This one you can put in Molly or Molly all over the place. Yeah. These here. We have had these, we're just reintroducing them. The uh, Justin Gingrich designed uh, GTI series for Gingrich Tactical Innovations, the GTI 3 and the GTI 4. This is beautiful Marcarta handles. This is S35 VN. This beautiful powdered steel, nice stone wash finish. Look at that. Uh, anything else new for this year? I mean, this is an impressive yes, setup here. We do have two. New to dealers, we've had these last year, but these are Todd Begg designs. This is part of his War Junkie series, but basically you have the Saw Mac V inspired fighter. We have a dagger. Oh. A personal defense kukri, smaller than other kukris. Wow, that is interesting. They can really do a job. Yeah, this is a smaller, I mean, if you guys know, kukris are normally larger. Mm -hmm. That's a nice handle. Massive recurve with that belly on there. Wow. They, they appear to be, you know, more bulky and heavier than they are. Yeah. But the edges are all chamfered, so they're very smooth to hold on to. Yeah, right around. Comfortable on your hands. It's like right about in these areas here, so you got no hot spots when you're cutting through big stuff. Yep. Yeah. Beautiful. And then finally, uh, this is the Exodus series which is in the bushcraft field, the Exodus 4 and the Exodus 3, um, they are little knives with a lot of power. Um, I gotta tell you, we, we took a white tail at Thanksgiving, and just as a test, we, we took this little guy- Just th with that. With this, and we, <laughs> we pulled it through five ribs effortlessly. Oh. <laughs> it just seems too small to do that. But it does. It's like a, a mini steak power. knife. It, it looks like it, yeah, it could be used. It's a settings. massive tang in here, too. Yep, you guys think that's a small knife? Look at how thick that tang is all the way around there. And it's lightweight. Yeah, you guys did a whole. Oh. Yeah. That's beautiful, too. That's mostly what's new for this year. Except there's one other item I'd like to show you that we're going to be introducing at Blade Show. We, oh. just, we do have a prototype here. Okay. I'll show it to you. Around. Walking around this side. So this is our Firecraft line, yep, which you've Firecraft. seen before. Yes. And we've come out with a Firecraft, a modified Kuko. This is designed by Jason Teets like these others. Mm -hmm. It's nice and thick, and we're putting it out in a Scandi grind. Look at that, I was going to say, look at that Scandi grind. That's beautiful. Oh, guys, Firestar is serious because it's got this little ditch in it right here. Yeah. Brad, you can put a fire stick in here and spin it in there, hold it on the top like that. For those of you who are adventurous enough to do that. <laughs> Scandi grind, so you can see here the grind here, this edge is different than that. And that's what a lot of bushcrafting people like is that nice, easy, sharpened edge up there for Scandi grinds. So if you put them next to each other, you can kind of see the difference in the edge there. That is a beautiful knife. That should be available by Blade Show. By Blade Show. All right, fantastic, John. Thanks for the interview. I'll get this posted for you guys. Thank you. Appreciate it.